Okay, so that's, um... Why am I hearing nothing now? I don't know. Checkity check check. Alright, I hear stuff. Well, yeah, but we Checkety didn't for a long check. time. <laughs> now we're hitting the loop. Alright, so let's mute that now. And let's see what we got over here. Because we want to make sure we can monitor chats, people. And we also want to check our camera angle. So, yeah, we are um, getting yeah, ready to do some cool stuff. Make sure I stand not on a button. Oh. Okay. There yeah. we go. Yeah, no, we're in frame. In fact, Does that look good? That looks good. I can even move the camera down a little bit. All right. But let me um, pop out the Twitch chat. We don't have a table this week because, like... Tables take up space, and we yeah. need a lot of space to move our limbs. Yes. But uh, we are going to do week two of Power Pad because we have some games we didn't cover last week, and My also... My hand's fucked. Her hand is, you know... So what do you do when your hand is fucked and you, you like use, to play video games? You use your feet. Although, I can't really use my feet with any of the other controllers. It gets messy and just... It doesn't work out. But thankfully, we have the power pad. Yeah. And uh, I'm still waiting on... Um, because I believe one on a holiday break and makes them by hand. But uh, Retro USB makes a USB NES adapter that is not only compatible with uh, NES um, uh, <laughs> control pads, but they will work with the power pad and the glove. And I know this because it said so on the internet. Um, and the internet would never lie Not to me. Not on this. Not, why would it lie to you? Well, why? Yeah, if they lie, then they, they get returns. Yeah, um, they want to keep your money. So, if, so it has to be true to an extent. If, if, if dude wants to keep money, dude better be telling the truth. But uh, no, we're going to do some more power pad. And we started uh, doing this uh, aerobic um, game a little last week. But it was at the end, after doing a bunch of other heavy-duty stuff, and, and we were like, nah, we're done. And we had the table over here, and the couch turned around, and so I didn't have room to like sit behind the power pad with feet down. It, it, I was messing up um, where we was at. And um, so we'll so see. we're warming up with some dance aerobics. Well, yeah, we're going to, yeah. Because or pad antics or whatever. Power we pad decide to do dance here. aerobics. And uh, let me um, see if we could adjust that camera angle down a little bit. Because now Dune, be able to. Dune didn't understand what we were doing completely. Oh, yeah. I mean, he understood that we were running and making lots of noise on our uh, condenser microphones. <laughs> yeah, I'm sorry. Uh, it was probably hell. It's probably going to be hell this week. I mean, it's like either us. we turn off the microphones and you just watch us, or we turn on the microphones and the, you hear some thumps along with our dialogue. Well, you don't you, you do miss the cursing and oh my god, this is so why is this is so long. Why do you have to do the bounces now? This is stupid. So, uh, yeah, now you can actually see from this uh, angle the power pad? You can see part of our Christmas tree and part of our power pad. All right. Uh, so yeah, that's, it was raining today, so the tree is still inside the house. Yeah. Uh, along with uh, I'm surprised there's still needles on the tree. Because Just wait till you you take the lights off of it. It's gonna be bald by the time we take it out. Oh yeah, well that's the thing. That's the thing. There's gonna be like five trees worth of needles on the floor. 
yet this thing will still be full of needles and dropping them along the way out yeah. the door. I guess last week we knocked off a bunch just by running in place. Today we're going to knock off a bunch running in place. Yes. And like I said, you still have the lights to pull down. if we move so. this over a little bit, we might get all the buttons okay. here. Now, Brian Blues is watching Wicked, the uh -huh. iOS YouTube app, added a chat. Now, that is awesome because now Brian can also tell us that he's awesome. watching us. Now, I am also using, I am using uh, Linux on a laptop to monitor the chats because I've decided, I, I got this old little laptop. Uh, used to belong to a uh, company that manufactures uh, corrugated board boxes uh, and used to be used Sorry. by a guy by the name of Marvin. And uh, Marvin always had the most interesting laptops because he traveled a lot mm -hmm. and liked to have the light laptops. And he had the, the clout to ask for something non-standard. Yes, because, you know, he was number two. And number two... It's close enough to number one that if you go, I want a laptop that's different from everyone else's, you, you get a laptop. Get it. Yeah. Not only that, but then he also go, here's my old laptop, here's my password, make the new laptop exactly like the old laptop, which is tricky when the old laptop is running XP and the new laptop has seven. Yeah. I, I actually had to adjust the size of icons on a Windows 7 desktop. To be match. To match, because Windows XP had smaller size. She can't kick as high as she can. It's, it's interesting, because as screen resolutions get higher, Windows versions accommodate for that. Mm -hmm. So by default, Windows 7 has larger icons than Windows XP. So when Marvin had all his icons arranged in a certain order, you know, you take like a capture of his desktop, you set it as a wallpaper temporarily on the new laptop so you can line up all the icons exactly. And then it's like, shit, I can only get <laughs> six icons and he's got seven. And Damn it, just and, enough variation. And he probably would be fine with that if I just rearranged it. But I really wanted to make this exactly the same <laughs> so I could hand it to him and it's exactly the same. Right. I mean, he made... His Wi-Fi router in his home was configured by an IT person to have the same name and password as a wireless router in the office. Oh, so he didn't even really have so, to think about it at all. So he took his, if, you, if his computer was on Wi-Fi in the office, he took it home. It was on Wi-Fi at home. Same router, same thing, same everything. So I'm warming up before the warm-up. You're warming up before the warm-up. But only Brian would be amused by this dialogue. Yeah, and he probably is. And uh, Brian says, as long as the tree isn't flaming, yep, oh, yeah. Linux fail. Hey, I have dance pads for my Wii. Now, dance pads for the Wii have nine spots you can step on because there's like a center of full, uh, and they have arrows in the directions in the corners. Oh, they, they have the, the, um, the DDR D dance pads only have four cardinal directions. Right. Well, did they have corners, though? No. no. So, so you, and it's, does the middle count? No, you, you stand in the middle, there's four buttons, there's front, so, back, left, right. So, so DDR only has four foot buttons? Yes. So this is like three DDR pads worth of buttons right yes, here. Yes, yes it is. Th we've come a lot, uh, we've, well, no, we've, 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 we've gone backwards. We've gone backwards. I was going to say, we've come a long way from DDR. No, this no. predates it. We've gone. <laughs> <laughs> well, if, I guess if you look at the Wii. Nintendo has uh, progressed further than, uh, I guess... Well, well they got the motion sensor Wait, and they had the on? board, but they never got... Here's the thing. Nintendo came up with an idea. Foot pad with 12 buttons, the possibilities are endless. And they came out with six games for the U.S. That are for pretty it. much running in place. Three of them are running in place. Possibilities are endless. One of them is aerobics. One of them is a police game, which also involves a lot of running in place. And one of them is a chicken coop that is also 12 chickens sitting on eggs in which you got to, you know, disarm well, that's the bombs. Why, that one's the most fun. That one is the most... We're going to have to revisit that. Yeah, we're going yeah, to we're gonna play Explode again. Yes. We're not doing the egg challenge again. No, we're not doing the egg challenge. I aced that. You've proven, I've proven you've proven that. I've proven myself. I've proven that you can do a... Turn instead of a shake, and all that not moving the egg. I never said I moved, didn't move the egg. I just said I could tell by weight or how it felt. Now, 
Brian points out that a device or laptop can link to multiple Wi-Fi routers with different names and passwords. That is true, but in order for Marvin's laptop to work on Marvin's home network, either he would have to configure it or someone would have to come home with him if it was different from the wireless router that was in the office. But because his wireless router at home was configured to be identical to the one in the office, that means that someone in IT there could set up his laptop and all he had to do was take it home and it automatically worked without even having to think about awesome. it. Awesome, I'm just kicked. Which gives thing. him all that much more time Good. to work on company policies against smoking pot. Yep. So um, there you go. I will, oh, I can, I can. And, can I kick and, him and I only hold it against him because he took yes. no questions. Maybe I can do it without the tippy toe? <laughs> No, uh, let's okay. not do that. I'm not going to kick over your head. We should I'll start playing kick, games. I'll probably kick you in the head if I try to so do that. So I played this last week and you didn't, so you get to start this week. This is dance aerobics. So um, there you go. So it starts easy. So you're standing in the middle there, and it's got nice green dots to show you that you're standing where you should be. And um, I'm going to sit and watch you do aerobics. All right. And monitor the chat. But Brian also has the Wii Balance board made by Nintendo. Oh, yeah. We got that, too. Now, this was not... I don't know if this was made by Nintendo. It certainly didn't originate from Nintendo. Um, it originated as a completely third-party um, uh, product that Nintendo at some point acquired rights to. But the games are still made by Bandai. Um, it and all but Short Order Explode was made by Bandai. Short Order Explode was actually made by Nintendo. And um, Japan got more Power Pad games than we did. But even so, all of the Power Pad games, including the Japanese ones that we didn't get, only use this side of the board. Because it's reversible. And the other side is laid out a little differently. It's laid out to not use the corners and not have the All right. spots numbered. Knee lifts. But um, some of the most collectible Nintendo games are original versions of Power Pad games before Nintendo acquired rights to things and rebranded some of the things. And uh, those are the types of things that will sell for up to over a thousand bucks, I believe, if you find like still sealed copies of pre Nintendo acquiring the rights to the power sense. pad. Because even though it's the same games and it plays the same, if you're gonna be a collector that's You, you want know, everything in box. And and you want, you know, every version or variation of things. Of course. Sometimes you gotta make that choice. Am I gonna be avid or do I wanna try to get as complete as possible right oh boy so I mean the question is when it comes to now that's the thing it doesn't look it only sees what your feet are doing not your legs so uh, as long as your foot isn't touching the pad for that period of time cuz yeah I can't kick or hold as high as she can yeah well you could always just like do a slow run in place, like lift your knee instead of lifting the leg. That's not the spirit of it, though. Uh, that, it's, it's close enough. <laughs> uh, Brian writes in uh, that his dance pass made by a third party. Uh, collectors are idiots. Whoops. Oh, I'm sorry, I think you're in the wrong spot, Brian. <laughs> Well, he means that, you know, people that collect things not to use them and will spend big money on things that... I mean, I, I collect things to use, and you're stepping in the wrong location. You're, you're off-center. Oh, shit. I yeah, wrong you, foot. You can watch the green dots to see when you go off. No, I know. Yeah. But I was trying to count, too. Oh. Oh. Fuck. Easy for you to say, lady. <laughs> you got one more mistake. Two, 
that's why I want two copies of this one game that I have two, I have two games that are sealed. Right. And I want another copy that isn't sealed so I can play it. Because I don't want to open up the sealed copy because they're rare enough as it is. Oh, it's cool to have some collectible things, but uh, now, now the thousands of dollars for original copy something. But then again, hey, like, I won! Yeah, you got the level done. Now, now the next level I didn't get through, but I it was because I wasn't able to sit back far enough. Yeah, so I might be able to get past it. Mm. <sighs> now, one thing I don't like. Is that the uh, whatever drivers Linux is using with the touchpad of this laptop? It recognizes the scroll options on the touchpad, but it doesn't recognize the tapping. Oh, that's annoying. Yeah, because I've gotten. All right. I've gotten accustomed to using touchpads in place of mice. Getting the being precise is very hard. Yeah, because your left foot's a little. Yeah. I can't hold this, but I just can't. <laughs> It's very hard, and I can move my um. hand. I actually can't do it. <laughs> it's it. Oh, it's fine. Oh, now it's making you do that. I could have probably. Well, no, actually, I was gonna try. I to can't do the hand ones because they want me to put my hand flat on the ground, and I really can't put my hand flat on the All ground. All right, let's see right if I can now. take over here. So I gotta get my feet on two and three. Yeah, your butt has to be on like nine and ten, or ten and eleven. Sorry, I just threw you into that one. Oh, wait, but I had that! It doesn't quite read all... It doesn't read things very accurately. Yeah, like your weight has to be right on those buttons. Yeah, you gotta have... Okay, well... Oh. Stand, you gotta stand up for the... No, stand up. Oh. I, somehow it's paused. All right, so I have to stand before Yeah, I you sit. have to stand up to warm up. All right, yeah, 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 yeah. You can't see my arms, what do you care? I'm totally warming up, and you can tell because those two green dots are down there. Oh, yeah, yeah. yeah All right, Brian yeah. says, touchpad instead of a mouse means that you're too cheap to buy a mouse. Hashtag troll talk. I have mice. <laughs> All right, now you're you're sitting down. Okay, so now we need to get down here. So your hands need to be on. Yeah, there you go. You need to pad out. One. Well, two, this is practice. Three, four. Yeah, but you need to make sure your hands stay on those buttons, and that's part of what I was having trouble with. I may have, I may have, if I took off my brace and really put my hand on the ground, I would be in a lot of pain, and it would be bad for my tendon, but I probably could do it better. All right, well, it's liking this, so this is good. Yeah. It's an awkward position. Yeah. If the power pad were a bit wider, because it is meant for kids, not for adults. Yeah. Yet, I that is what, what we've. That is the most. That is the most important, important thing. We've thing. Yeah. Brian says, "LOL about you affording having plenty of mice." Right. Yeah, it's just that um, well, the Lenovo touch pairs have gotten good at because you can easily scroll with the two finger. You got to keep your butt on ten and eleven. Seriously? Yeah. Because I lean a little off one of them. 
Actually, I don't know. It's not reading your left lean. Because you're getting dinged on that, but not I'm totally right. doing this right. No, you are. I don't know. There's something up. I'm sorry. Am I not paying attention to you? Anyways, no, but the Lenovo touchpad, you, you drag two fingers and you scroll. And you tap and that's clicks. And doing that, you can really do some good mouse moving with a touchpad that's convenient enough. But this old uh, Dell doesn't recognize the double drag as scroll. It, but if you, if you swipe on the edges of, of the pad, the, the right edge and the bottom edge, that's what it does for scrolling. And that's taking me some getting used to, but it is working. But like I said, Linux is not recognizing tapping the pad itself as a click. So I have to use the buttons to click. Okay. This again? Yep. Well, the t once you inevitably fail this because it doesn't read the left one properly, we'll have to try some of the other things in this game. Oh, come on! I'm totally doing this right! You are wrong! It's okay. It's okay. That's, He's just a main angry man. It's fine. That's bullshit. That is absolutely bullshit. Yeah, that was bullshit. All right, we don't want to do this. Now, anymore. Brian is clarifying. So it has a butt button. Apparently, you have to keep your butt on both of these. Yes, that's what I was saying. And but only, yeah, but I wasn't even 100% sure because I was missing the eight. So, I mean, you basically, each cycle counts as a mistake. So if you make... You complete this level? I just press select and then start. Okay, great, great. Let's, if it, yeah. Yeah, you're right. You're right, we completed this level. We totally completed the level. Because that's your problem that you don't like where my butt hey, was for all moments. This lady's tan. You want to do this one or should I do this one? I, I think it's your turn. All right. I can't handle all this warming up. <laughs> oh shit, we're faster now. Yeah, except that uh, I'm all totally off. Yeah, I know. <laughs> this is just stretching. All right. Oh, whoa. One, two, three. I'm not jumping right now. <laughs> it's taking it. Oh, let's see. Nope, it's not liking that. No, it it's needs fine. to be a hop. <laughs> All right, let's you know. see if I can do this. Oh. Oh, that one's easy. You can uh, do that one. Okay. Uh, yeah, let you. Nope, you're going the wrong order. Blue. Uh, you're off center. I know, fuck! I can see the buttons. And yet I made it. So it, uh... Oh, that's doable. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. Oh, it's being way too sensitive I, over that. I can't stay on the buttons, that's my problem. So, so I'm gonna... I'm used to bigger buttons. No, it's still making us do this level. All, All right, right. Your turn. let's see if I can well, do you this. We have to restart it. All right. All right. And do that. And do that. And Brian. Do that. And do that. I'm gonna 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 call my brother. I'll check back later. See ya. Or yeah, f bomb. Yeah, you you check back. <laughs> I guess Brian's our official fuck counter. Yeah, that's how you do it. What? 
the I don't know, you're doing it. It, it counted that one. Okay, you're done. Staying on the buttons was my problem with uh, short order. Oh my god, I can't do this. You can do it. Oh, she's done. Now you're doing the jump on the leg. Oh yeah, Brian's, Brian will be counting our F bombs. Now he's gone, so... You did it! He's gone to talk to his brother on the phone. Yeah. Okay, I'm just making sure. Oh, it's not counting that. It knows when you're cheating. I need to. It's not counting them even when you jump on. Oh, no, back to the hopping side to side. But this is... Yeah, it's not happening. But we're getting past this level. You're off. There you go. <laughs> Do we really need to get past the level? Yes. Okay. Chantica thinks we've lost our minds. Cats always think we've lost our minds. I guess that's true. I'll do the next one. Yeah, I think the next one is going to be the last one we do. Okay, it's just jumping forward. Okay, no, you... Okay. I'm not hopping anymore. I, I gotta... Well, you, you, I said I was going to do the next one, but I guess you're fine with just doing your hands. Well, next level, I thought you meant. Oh my god, is this level not over yet? It's the last one. Remaining, one routine. So I just do this without hopping, at least. Yeah. Two, three, four, one, 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 two, there you go, you did it! Oh my god. Do the circles of your arms as you cool down. Yeah, sure, that helps. It allows everyone to see my gut as my shirt lifts up. All right. Okay, let's see how long I last with this one. Yeah. Let's see. See, that was my problem with um, short order. I was losing track of the buttons. And it's hard to keep track because the thing slides around a little bit and you move around a little bit. But once it gets repetitive and you hear the count, you can just do a lot of looking down. Yeah, well. Oh, oh. yeah, we're not doing this one. I can't do this one. All right. My, I can't with my hand. That's the thing. Well, I think we can. Uh, do you want to reset and do anything else with this? Because there are other, there are other features things. on this game that we can show off to all the viewers out there. Oh shit, there's another ornament I didn't take off. I'll take it off after. This requires me to stand up and walk. Alright. Alright, we're not doing past step is how you jump to other the past things. Pediatics is the other stuffs. So we could do Matt Melodies, which has to do with music. Yep. And as you can see, it's starting from the top going on the top left. I don't know this. All right, so we got to do 
twinkle, twinkle little star. So you do this so much better than I would, because I don't fucking know. We're supposed to be alternating feet. So there we did that. Yep. Thing is, it doesn't really tell us what things what to expect until we get there and it shows the feet, and then you don't really have time to prepare. Right. That's why you're. And that's much, the same melody. You're much better at this than I am because you know the notes. Because yeah, I know the Sound of Music song. But I don't know what that really means. My music education really sucked. That sounded pretty. Yeah. I didn't like you for doing it, but it sounded no. pretty. Well, this can bite me. See, once it'd be perfect. It's just giving me the same melody over again, over right. again. Oh, do I have to get it perfect before I think let's you, move I on? I think you have to admit, get it perfect. All right, let's see if I can do this. No. Will you let me do something else? I gotta go on to the next one. Nope, fuck you. Back to his... Still Melody 1. Oh. Hi. Oh, it's doing that. a nice cool down, right? Okay. Yeah, let's give you a kiss my breath. Oh, that was good enough. Oh, no. <laughs> no, this is where the shark thing comes up on uh, DDR. See, I don't even know what this tune is. It's trying yeah, to... I have never heard of that before. But it wasn't good enough, so you got to play it again. Hi. Oh, here's the point so fast. I'm sorry, I shouldn't be joking around about it, because, like, I can't do it any better. We can restart this and try something else. Well, this is pretty much it. Really? What's this for? There was another selection in the menu. Hi. Let's let Chantico get on the pad. Maybe she'll do better. We need the laser pointer. If she were more... Yeah. <laughs> My book is better than theirs. It really is. Alright. Alright. Well, that's that game. Oh, we're just going to move on? I'm going to get a drink of water. I didn't think about it.
Well, well I don't thought it. Table. Okay, let's see what four is. Oh right, this is like. Well, I'm gonna do it anyway. It's more of this stuff. Okay, yeah, you're right. Never mind. <laughs> Things is a fun little diversion. I thought there was gonna be a, like actual dance, like. Well, if you play it far enough. Uh. I mean, how much dance can you do? I guess that's true. On a twelve square pad. That is why Dance Dance Revolution gives you a nice four buttons to deal with. Anyways, so I think next we'll do this game that I bought that I don't even know if it works yet, and I don't know if I'm going to need to clean it or not. Oh man, you didn't even clean it? Well, I didn't even think about that until it was too late. Uh, well, we right. can do that now. Okay. So I'm going to, and this is a good chance for us to review how to clean your carts. This is now, very important if you're going to get into this kind of now thing. Now, I've been doing this with one Q-tip at a time, but this guy showed me that he was using two Q-tips. Now he was showing me this on Nintendo 64 games and rubbing alcohol. So you, you kind of wet the uh, Q-tips with uh, some rubbing alcohol. Oh, two at the same time? Yeah, well he get two of them side by side with the rubbing alcohol and then he got the dry side to dry off. Ah. And that's the real test. If the dry side comes back clean, back clean you know you're good. Right. Okay. Whereas, but I've been doing that with the single Q-tips for a while now. Yeah. Although games are pretty bad, I use a little uh, the, the metal polish right. before I do the uh, rubbing alcohol. Now, I think some people are like just rubbing alcohol only, but I have read things online from people that are like, well, I start using a little metal polish on them. Well, on the tougher ones, yeah. For most parts. And I've found that you know, regular not... use, so you know, you're rubbing alcohol and I mean, is I tested adequate. It before I started doing it on all games, and I found that, you know, it does a good job polishing up the. Uh, I mean, it's made of polished metal. What are these contacts? Metal. Yeah. It's not it makes like sense. I'm. It's not like I bought a bottle of Metal Destroyer. I mean, that <laughs> would be terrible. That would be terrible. All right. Well, that game's looking pretty good. Okay. You know, a lot of sellers clean them before they send them anyway, which yeah. they should. Any good seller, which is not every seller on eBay, uh, should yeah. be cleaning these games. So we're gonna turn this off for a moment, and we'll be back. So, the new game I got today, Athletic World, is not working. And last week we played some Super Team games that Chris wanted to revisit this week, and that cartridge was giving us trouble, and still is. So, Actually, just wanted to play it by myself, but I didn't think of it because I had other things to do. So while you're... Well, I want to find the metal polish, but yeah. where'd that little metal polish go? I don't know. I thought I had it. It should have been among the stuff, right? The the carts and stuff. Oh, here we go. Excellent. So I'm, I'm gonna, gonna play some Explode while you go ahead and work on those two. Yeah, I'm gonna. Hopefully, work. we'll get the uh, new one working because that would yeah, be fun. Yeah, yeah, but then again, this is bought by a seller on eBay that 
probably didn't even bother to test it. Right. So. I was going to ask you if you, like, got a guarantee or something. Like, uh, well, yeah, this is totally working. It's, 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 but e it's eBay. It's so. eBay. We're. Ah, oh, shit. I accidentally stepped on that. Because there's no safe place to step on the power pad. There's no safe place. And also, bombs can just turn into eggs. Well, yeah, any... but that usually happens later on in the game. You know, where it gets faster. And like I said, I'm not great at the placement of the buttons, but I like this game. It's fun. And it's really easy to just stay on the buttons. <laughs> it's a good high-paced game, but at least it doesn't involve as much jumping around. Yeah. Oh, man. Oh, no! Oh. That's okay. I'll play again. It's like I said, it's fun. Man, this game is dirty. Ah, shit! <laughs> you know, you're, you're repeating your last game, I think. I am. Stepped on an egg the first round, stepped on an egg the first round this time, too. Yeah. It gave me three eggs. Usually it just gives you one, if anything. Or maybe, I don't know. Like, like I'm talking like I play this game a lot. Ah, oh, too late. Man, this car has got some serious grime on it. Well, hopefully that means it's a fun game. Although I guess it doesn't matter how used the game is. I don't know. I just know, I just know that, that means the seller did not do any cleaning of the carts that he's selling. Alright, well, stay away from that person. Yeah. Well, the game works, it's fine. Yeah, yeah. Nothing wrong with the... I mean, it's good practice to clean the carts you buy, but it's also good practice to clean the carts you sell. I mean, that's just nice. You give him feedback already? Uh, well, I'm not gonna ding him for something like that. If it works, whatever, you know, it's like whatever. Oh, shit. I was standing on that button, the egg was on. <laughs> Thankfully, well, you got didn't... off in time, it sounds yeah, like. Yeah, it didn't register. That's good. Yeah, that's why last weekend we decided, hey, let's buy a Nintendo 64 as a Christmas gift for my nephew. Because we didn't see him for Christmas, we are seeing him for New Year's. Ah, poop. And, uh, so I went to the flea market, bought a Nintendo 64. Now I look my age. I look like someone that grew up through the Nintendo era. Yeah. Super Nintendo era. The, and this guy I buy the uh, system from. He takes a moment to, well, let me teach you how to properly clean the games for this thing. I guess you do, do look like someone's dad, but like a dad from our generation. Right. Like, you or, know, like, because we're barely in the I, same generation. I don't generation. look like someone that's a newbie getting into this, and I don't think I necessarily look like someone that I'm buying this for my kids and don't know what I'm buying. Because yeah. It's from my era. So I don't understand where he's like, let me teach you the right way. I mean, obviously he's got a blanket policy to do this for everyone. Right. But it's like... That's why you didn't stop him. 
Right. Because it was, oh, but, shit, I almost stepped on that one. But it's like, you know, you could do a little, like, do you know how to clean the games? Or, you know, or, yeah. or, you know rather than, you know, like. Assuming. It's, it's, it's kind of like when someone calls me on the phone, even if I'm 99% sure this is an idiot that doesn't know which password they're typing in, I still approach it with the benefit of the doubt. Yeah. So as not to call someone and imply someone's an idiot. I mean, that's just good customer service. Yeah. Not that you were going to like, well, harumph, I will take my business elsewhere. No, no. Because, well, they had what we're looking for. $50 Nintendo 64 with controller that is uh, a tight stick and is yeah, not no, a third party. Yeah, that was a good controller. You know. Oh, that was a good jump. So yeah, this is probably the uh, best of the power pad games. I like it the best. Yeah, I, I, uh, I like the uh, super whatever obstacle shit. Oh, but you couldn't even you couldn't finish a course. <laughs> I couldn't, but I still enjoyed. It. I like the aesthetic of it, I guess. Like if I were going to you know put a running game on for somebody, I probably would do track and field because that's easier. Oh, uh, you mean world class track me? Yeah, sure. Yes. No, that is what I meant. Well, that one gives you the, you know, first but person perspective behind the runner, whereas the um, Super Team Games gives you this, like, side view. So it doesn't even feel like you're really running. It, it just feels like you're controlling someone oh, else's running. I almost stepped on that one. I mean, that is what you're doing. Right, but when you do it, like, looking at the, down the track, that's a little more... Immersive? Yeah. So I don't understand. Hey, now look at me doing better. The thing Super Team Games has going for it is you can set it up to be a large multiplayer game. Oh. So that that is cool that you can have a, a party with a bunch of people and pull out Super Team Games and everyone participates in the contests. So, you know, you can have a power, power pad party. Yeah. Power pad party. Say that ten times fast and you're going to... Ooh. Close calls there. Yeah, thankfully they're not throwing eggs at me. Got a good round going this time. Ooh. Oh, oh, it's okay, it was done. So it's coming back Yay. to adjust. Oh, now we're going. See, this is where knowing the button, where the buttons are, really, really comes in handy. handy. Or footy. <laughs> oh, that was bad. It was. Forge would have been proud. Yep, well, gotta do my dad proud. <laughs> why you get the beak. Yes. Or the tail. Because oh, of the, the squirrel. Tail. The, uh, I the tail of the squirrel. Oh, that's right. The outtake had you talk about a beak. Yeah. It was the tail that you... Uh, it was the tail in the actual yeah. special. Oh, that was close. Yeah. I thought that one was going to go. Good thing they give you points for flashing ones, huh? Yeah. Oh. The, and the timers, the, the detonators all, the, the timers are all different. All right. All right. Well, I guess I should do a I'm round gonna of that. I'm going to take a swallow of water. Swallow. A more. I didn't take note of what your score was, so I don't know how. <laughs> oh, I didn't either. <laughs> well, if anyone out there is watching. Write in and tell us who won. It's, a co it's always a competition. <laughs> he the fan fan says stomp stomp. Stomp it is stomp. Yep. Then. Yeah, that is. Gotta stomp out the bombs. That's the power pad. Stomp 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 stomp. Oh, you stayed on the egg! That's bullshit. Oh, 
Ooh, Carol, close. I know you're just on that button. I like to say uh, hello and welcome to people who are watching now and probably weren't watching at the beginning. If you've joined us, hello. Hope you're having a good, a good time with us. We're having a good time. We're playing a much better game than what we were playing half hour yes, ago. Yes, yes. Aerobics suck. Yeah, dance aerobics sort of power pad is not fun. No. Unless you're a small like a child who can hit all the buttons with and even then, a proper. I'm not so sure how much fun that game is. Yeah. I'm not sure if anyone ever said, yay! Dance aerobics. I'm gonna fake six, stay home from school to play dance aerobics. I think it'd be more fun to actually do the aerobics with the, you know, the daytime exercise programs that were on at that time. If they're they're not been, on now. If Nintendo had an interactive, uh, because they had that, like, you know, interactive dial in service that, like, those Zelda games uh, were oh, on. Oh, yeah. And if they could have done some power pad games with that, they could have had an exercise program with the power pad. Mm-hmm. Uh, Jose Guzman says, wow, that's a hilarious game. Yeah. They said, best power pad game. It really is. Like, short order is okay. Yeah, but short order didn't need the power pad. It was just an excuse to have. Yeah, the... this is the game. Yeah, this is the highlight. This is about. I thought it was going to be like Burger Time, where you had to step on the ingredients and. No, or it's, try to, it's like... just it's just Simon, but jumping around the board. Yeah. Whereas this game is actually kind of creative and different. Nice save. Thank you. Alright, Five Hit Dune says, Well, other than wanting to throw all my radio stuff out the window, I'm having a good night. The monkey smiles. Oh, uh, you need to call whoever. Oh. Oh, uh, we. I think I had a higher score. Yeah, I think you did too. Dune needs to call someone for support. <laughs> he hasn't done this yet? Great, tomorrow's show, his computer's gonna crash. Alright, do you wanna try uh, Athletic World now? Yeah, let's see if we can get Athletic World to work, because this is the last of the... This was the first of the Power Pad games, and the last one I got that showed up yesterday? Yeah, yeah, yesterday. Yeah. So we're going to turn this off, the sound's going to cut for a moment. We'll be back. to wiggle it. Hey, this uses A. Does it? It says A, doesn't it? It says mat A. I don't know if that means side A. I thought none of them use that side. But why would it say A if it wasn't A? Huh. Well, like, I mean, I guess we could try it either way. Alright. You know what? I need to Google this. So... That was difficult to get working, and I 
I have a feeling when we start jumping around, it's going to give us trouble. Yeah. But let's um, look a little bit uh, at what this game says. And uh, so let's see what we're going to do. Because uh, everything that said B, but like this actually says A. So but yeah, it doesn't say side A, it says power pad A. And this game does predate the Nintendo version of the power pad. So I don't even know if that's... Oh, look Let at me, that. Athletic World. All right, let's take a look here. Athletic World NES. There we go. Yeah, I bet you're getting uh, stuff for like off-brand Discovery Zone things. Let's see. Athletic World's video game release for the... Yeah, no kidding. Uh, yeah, I know that much. This game notably is one of the games that have compatibility with the power pad itself. Well, duh. Alright. Um, this doesn't tell me like what side it uses or instructions for it. Uh, price and value. Game facts. Here we go. Five exciting playing fields, three different skill levels. Oh, maybe this is screen. the one you learned, you thought about the log. Well, yeah. Um, the other one has it too. Okay. Um, has some log stuff. Let's see what we got here. There we go. FAQ walkthrough. This will tell us stuff about it. It hopefully should. It's a FAQ worth its salt. Background control. Let's we'll see about this guy. This guy. Da, 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 da. Background. For the controls, the NES controller is only necessary for selecting levels. Alright. And inputting. The power pad, only side A is... Not, I didn't think anything used it. I thought that was a... a, a, a uh, We're going to flip the map. We get to flip the map! To this side, it doesn't look very different, but... It has makes, less buttons. If we do it on the other side, left will be right and right will be wrong. Uh, so, I think we need to start with a little training. Yes. I, I think it's your turn because I did the last egg All right. explode. Oh, I'll have to wait till it goes back. If you hit start, it should. Oh. Or select or something. There we go. So, let's, there we go. Training hurdles. Yeah, why not? So, this is another one of these side view ones. It's not really all that immersive, but it's one player. So, the team one is multiplayer. So, this has got. I mean, this is the starting point of the power pad. So yeah, you don't jump in place. Oh. Oh, okay. That works. Oh. oh. Yes. Controls are difficult. You gotta time it just right. Oh. <laughs> Come on, buddy. Oh, I thought you were oh, on the other side. Apparently you can uh, go to the two left buttons or the two right buttons to move to different parts yeah, of the lane. Yeah, no. that's what I saw. Oh, come yeah. on, buddy. The turtle's going to beat us. There we go. Or is the turtle us? I mean, the turtle keeps moving even when oh, that's true. we're not moving, so... So we don't even know how close we are to the goal. Oh! So close! There All we right, go! Alright, we, we burnt... Fuck you, turtle! We burnt the turtle! 19! I don't know what that means! So, why is it we're racing Mitch McConnell? Oh, that was a turtle! <laughs> that was a turtle. It was a turtle. Oh, could I have to... I was gonna say, wow, they really predicted the uh, future there. There we go. Uh, select button, of course, to select the stage. Alright. The animal trail. <sighs> See, we can... Come on. Come on, kid. There we go. That's how you change lanes. Oh, I see you. Do 
that. You could, if you touch one and two, you're in a crouch position. I don't know when that's necessary. I mean, if you touch one and two while being on. Yeah, I thought there was something like that. Sorry, I'm being huh. very slow. Oh, something's you side B. Okay, so it does switch. Oh wait, the controls below are not recommended for this game. I have tested them and they do not work. Below are listed hypothetically control uh, setups. Those boars move too fast for me to switch. I need to be on my, my toes. Oh. <laughs> Try jumping. Didn't work. So yeah, you have to avoid You're the animals. The goal. Yay, you beat McConnell. 20. That is a higher number than 11. Uh, 13, 19. Brain, wow, come on. Yay, we brain. can do it. Atari style game, LOL. Olympic style game in the woods. Let's see, let's go ahead and do Dark Tunnel. Because I might as well do go through all of them. Because I want I to. I mean, if you're up to it, at some point, you just feel free to hand it off if you're like, I, I can do this no more. Oh! You can do it, buddy! Go! Oh, yes! Good job, Kai! So this is really more just running in place. Yeah, it is. So I see training puts a turtle up against... So, so it's basically the training or beginner expert modes have to do with probably what's the battle's keeping pace. Yeah. Whatever. Yeah, I'm probably going to take a break after this one. Well, oh, it looks like three, four, four, five, five, six is more of an expert mode setting. Simply say on four or five, start to race and start jumping. There we go. Don't go into a hurdle. Lift one leg to cause the character to jump. After clearing the hurdle, immediately drop the leg and start running again. And the edge along the air, the character will crash. Beginner mode, do exactly as we be done. Training mode, different difference now. And though is tray, be perfect as possible. Avoid crashing because even though you may receive hundred at the end. The numbers keep going up. Don't know what that means. Expert still. mode. Place your feet on four or five to start, but then immediately move your character to the top of the screen, five and six, to avoid the moles. After the seventh hurdle, move your character to the lowest level. So there's more obstacles when you get to expert level. I don't see what seven that makes and sense. eight do. Possibly seven and eight. Oh, this is... They go through each game, the animal trail. Uh, almost basically the same when starting, furry creatures will start to run after you. The easiest way to avoid them is either move to the side, preferable, or jump backwards, waste time. Going 7 and 8 jumps backwards, I guess. Okay. Alright, so... I'm Your gonna... turn. Try training. Training probably is the best option for us old yeah. fogies. Yes. Alright. Let's see here. Now you already did the hurdles, Animal Trail, the Dark Tunnel. Oh, that's the hop -a I should probably start with uh, something easy, so I'm going to start with hurdles. Oh, I just too soon. Small problem with a uh, old, outdated system that has become uh, sensitive to motion with a accessory that requires a large amount of motion. Yeah. Uh, yeah. I'm switching back to the YouTube and then the second yeah. Firefox for the for Twitch. Twitch. All right. All right. So let's see if we can do this again without shaking the room too much. Rafting is where you uh, do, do, duck down. There's things you can jump over, and there's also things you could. Oh. You can jump over. Oh, come on, I hopped. It's funny how you were saying, no, there are no games that use side A, and now we're playing a game that uses yeah, side A. Yeah, I didn't really, I, I, somehow I missed that. 
But then again, I didn't know much about this game. Right. And it was like the one game I didn't read details on, because, like, I always thought it was the same thing as World Class Track because I knew it had two different names. And I saw this as, like, the first game. And I thought World Class Track Me was the first game. All right. That's about you all the done. running I could do. All right. Well, you're oh, just God. about there. Just keep jumping. I like how you jumped backwards over. Well, that's over here. I touched yeah. the two behind. Yeah, that happens. Oh, I believe my me. God. Oh, God. This was made for kids. I can't do this stuff anymore. <laughs> All right. Let's try one more thing. And then I'm going to go throw up. All right. Shouldn't have had that beer, huh? Oh, no. Beer's good. All right. So this is where I got to, um, let's see. Going to the left goes low, going to the right goes high, I guess. Or is it the other way around? I think it's the other way around, actually. Yeah. Oops, wrong way. Huh. Has he got a jump? I jumped to the side? Oh, well, you did a long jump back. There you there go. There we go. Oh, what did I don't know. Oh, come on. I I I'm thinking. It, yeah, it's reading that you're trying to go over. But I'm not trying to go over. Hey, whatever works, right? Maybe this is what's supposed to happen. Because if I go back onto that red pad, it says I'm going back to the middle, but right. I don't think the other levels. So it must be one foot on the lock. The lock looks, sort of looks like a uh, ho ho. You know, that rolled hostess snack cake. Yes, I know what a ho-ho is. Okay, I'm just making sure. <laughs> you know what? Everybody who's watching this may know what a ho-ho is. But then again, they might not. If they don't know what a ho-ho is, they probably don't know what a hostess snack cake is. Chocolate roll. There you go. <laughs> Hopping is better than running. <sighs> Cheating. Whatever. It's better than running. Shall we move on? Go to a different game, or? Well, do you want to play more of this game? Um, not really. No, no. I could try to let, 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 uh, let me do the rafting. These part. episodes are usually short episodes, <laughs> and I mean, usually, as in, we did one of these last week, we do one this week. We can only handle so much power pad. Uh, uh, let me at least I'll do rafting, and then I think maybe we'll, we'll do. S now. If I get the emulator USB control for the power pad, we could do some more mapping the power pad to be a standard controller on an emulator type of things, which will probably be less strenuous. Ah, oh, shit. Yeah, you gotta be perfect with the timing. Oh. I think I gotta jump forward. Let me try, try that. Try to jump on the log, because then you'll be jumping sooner. Like, time it like you would be... Uh, yeah, they really don't, uh... Well, I did it better that time. I actually jumped. Hey! Man, this one sucks. I think other difficulties throw in the, the crouching. I, I don't understand why the power pad was a miserable failure. I, I don't I get it I either. Oh, there we go. No, you touch, touch one and two. Oh, okay. Touch one and two while still standing on four and five. No, no, no. No, I did it. Touch with your hand. Oh, what the fuck? You're crouching. Crouching. Ow, <laughs> damn it, that hurt. Oh, I'm sorry. That was bad. That was bad. Can't... I can't do that with this hand. Oh, I'm sorry. I, I can't do it flat. That's the that's I, the. I didn't realize touching it was gonna. No, that was the reason why I couldn't do the dance aerobics. It wasn't just because I was like tired of it. 
It was, I can't lay the hand all right, flat. Well, we, all right, it's my turn. Okay, I got it, but... <laughs> damn it, this fucking hand. Yeah, yeah, that's why we're doing foot controls. And when they want you to use your hands on the foot controls, it just throws it all off. Yeah. All right, let's go for the goal. Oh my god, they want a lot of information. Why? I, I, well, there's no network connection here, so this should be fine. So. Oh, by the way, I'd like to fr thank my friend Ian Lee, because it's thanks to him that Johnny Gators officially has an IMDb entry. <laughs> Oh, you don't get to choose what thing you practice when you do this. Okay. Jose Guzman says, help, help, I can't swim for athletic guy, LOL. Oh, you got to go up here. <laughs> Come on. See, on x you're probably doing all of them. Breathing heavy into the microphone for the ladies. No. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, see, you gotta do all of them. Oh. And there goes that last ornament. All right. I don't know what that was, but that was weird. Uh, I'm done with this. We done with this? I'm done with this. Okay. All right. So, now that brings us to one oh, last I game. Oh, I forgot the camera. <laughs> one last game that is extremely uh, active and uh, exhausting. So, I'm so glad we saved this for last. Because this is the most interesting game. But uh, maybe we'll have chances to rest up. All right. <laughs> so we'll be right back as soon as we switch carts. So, I don't know if this game tells us the controls or if I need to look them up. I think I have to look them up. Alright. But it's definitely a side B game. Yep, it says it right there. And this is Street Cop. So, a game where we get to run around as a cop is certainly, when you read about it, it's like, well now they're actually doing something cool with the power pad. Instead of running on a track, you're being a cop chasing criminals. And then you try playing it and you find out, no! It's pretty much the same thing, just with something different on the screen. You know what we should play after this? Duck Hunt. I could play Duck Hunt one Today? Day. Yeah, why not? Uh, okay. It's on Super. It's on Nintendo, and you have the gun, and it's one-handed, and we don't have to run in place. Yeah, we could do that. And that way we don't end after an hour of streaming. Which, I mean, well, we've already done more than we that. We have done more than that. But, but that we, could we, go, we could go to 10 at least. Yeah. If we do that. All right, so let me at least get some controls for this game. Yeah. So, um... Because I'll, I'll, I'll play since I've recovered. Here we go. Pack walk through. So, yeah, uh, this game... Ben is a rookie cop fresh out of the police academy. Uh, he grew up on the crime ridden streets of the city. As a young boy, he dreamed of one day becoming a great detective so he can clean up the streets of his neighborhood. He doesn't look like a detective, though. Is yeah. he not a detective? Well, he's a rookie cop. 
Uh, okay. So. He dreams of becoming a great detective, but he's a rookie cop. All right. So um, number one is item use. Uh, number two, three is squat or turn. Number four is a baton. Uh, five is shifting to the left. Six and seven is your run forward mm -hmm. chase. Uh, eight is a right shift. So you basically so got your left, left shift. Turn left, turn right. Turn left, turn right. Uh, nine. A baton and four. Ten and eleven is a direction control. Nine and twelve is item use. Um, All right. So I don't know the details, but basically four is your baton. So as you're passing someone, hit four, and you can whack them with your baton. And I think one lets you throw bombs if you have. All them. right, we're looking for Snatcher Joe. So y you do a lot of running back and forth. Now I don't know if that's actually a bad guy, um, but I think you're 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 um, no that's I think that might be a just a pedestrian um, because you see you're the blue dot and that other dot that's moving is wherever the bad guy is hiding. So you want to kind of get over there and start. Police brutality in the game! Look, no one's stopping me from hitting them. Yeah. I, I think if you... Oh, okay. Oh, I see. I think you gotta, like, hit next to wherever the crate they, they are. And, yeah, and you can shift around. Oh, damn. And you should be able to somehow turn around. Maybe that's the back one? There you go. So now you can... So from there you can kind of shift around your directions and where you are. And... I played and beat this level by swinging the baton when I was near areas where that dot was, and it made a bad guy appear. But I don't know how it. I don't. I don't know exactly how it happened or how it works, but it kind of works. Come on, over here, over here, over here, over here. I think I, that's the other. Okay. I think that's maybe that is the bad guy that's running away. Yeah, that guy in the green shirt. He's that dot that you're pursuing. All right. Although now he's gone and you went past him, so he must be hiding in that crate or something. Okay, so I do want to be over here. Let's turn around. Wow, this is not confusing yeah, at all. This this game sounds cool, and then you play it, and it, it sucks. Really bad. Really, really, really bad. There we go. Oh, but he hit me. Oh, there we go. I got right. one. Yeah. Got him. Yeah, now we got Turn around him. and go. Oh, no. Down there. So, yeah, I guess if it's moving, they're actually on the screen. And when it's still, they're hiding someplace. Um, but I'm just guessing as I observe. I mean, that's as good as guess as any. Yeah. Oof, excuse me. There you go. There, good. All right, got him. Turner, oh, nope. Yeah, someone's over there. Now, this is like your introduction level because this one street, one line. Yeah. But uh, other levels actually have like a, a, a small grid. So, yeah, you could like turn, face nope, the other nope. direction, and go down an alley, which takes you down another road. So, there's a more active map to be pursuing and finding that. I mean, I like the idea. It's just it's that... It's just frustrating. Well, it's it's so exhausting. And okay, nope, not that one. To, to play a whole game running in place is just too much. It really is. It might be that cart. It might be there. There we go. All right. Oh, let me grab that. Oh, right. There we go. And... The items are a bit confusing. I don't know. Yeah. Are they necessary? Well, maybe they, later. They help. Throwing bombs helps. Baton is adequate, but you get someone from a distance if you toss a bomb. And, oh, you can hop. Yeah, no, I've been hopping sporadically. Like I'm jogging because I want to conserve my energy, but he only moves so fast. 
even when I pick up the pace, like this is as fast as I want to go because I'm, my knees are old, my hips are fucked. Yeah, we're sparing the hands, but not the knees. <laughs> yeah, everything tonight. else is kind of out of it, and that's why I'm going to take three All ibuprofen. Right. Well, I'm going to take this opportunity to turn off my mic and pee. I'll All take right. the batteries out of the charger. Sounds good. All right, creeping up on the perp. Because he's in a box. You've got to sneak up on the criminals, or else they're going to... Man, there's a timer too. Yeah, there we go. Oh, he's got more health. Yeah, Turn the fuck around. Hey, Snatcher Joe, I got you. You fucker. No more snatching for you. On uh, just Lewis. I see. Yeah, that. <laughs> That jumps up quite a bit. Alright, turn around. No. Wanted that giant turkey. Lewis. He looks like he has a beak. There we go. Turn around. Let's see. I think we'll probably go up this alleyway. Nope, nope, wrong way. How do I... Item? Oh, no, that's item. So next week you're here, right? Yes. And it's the week after that you're away? Yeah. Okay, so... How do I go up there? Um, well, you gotta turn and face that direction. I think. So something lets you... I don't know. There's a way. What do the side buttons do? Nope. We'll Maybe try going... Them down. We'll try These going... These are item buttons. We'll try going back in front of it and then do the right one again. Because that let you move up. So if you move up more, you'd be going into it, right? That's what I was trying to do. Huh. Hope that's the wrong one. Huh. Maybe I'm not right in there. Try the forward. The, both the forwards. The, the, the two, three. <laughs> what, what forward? Well, two, you three are in front of you, aren't they? You should have said buttons. Buttons two and three. No? Huh. That's a jump. Weird. All right. There's a way to do it, and it seemed more obvious to me when I was doing this. But I... Let's try this way. Yeah, yeah, I'll be here next week. It's the week after that I will be away dog sitting. All right, let me read more yeah, controllers because it's not... The controls are pretty bad on these games. Let's see, we try it this way. Nope, that's the wrong I guess. Okay. Oh, working. Using the six and seven to start run. Ben was at three different speeds, select running a player. Um, oh, I should have tied my hair back. To turn left or right, step on two or three, and then put your foot back to the number you were on before the turn. And continue walking away press six and seven. To make Ben change direction, step on on ten or eleven with one foot. Yeah. No, what does two or three do? I don't know. Huh. 
turn left or right, step on two or three, and then put your foot back to the number you were on. So... Well, walk in place and then do it, and then keep walking in place. Oh, that's just moving up. Okay, that's... Huh. Let's make them squat down. Each time you step on eight, Ben slowly changes course right. So I mean, on five, Ben slowly changes to make Ben swing his baton. It's not very easy to understand when you go. Anyway, let's see. Items. Yeah, batons for item is one, nine, subway, and. Enter building with a subway sign, the screen display chain. But how do you enter these things? Then you'll never get past Rookie Cop if you can't go down side streets. Like, ooh, that's an alleyway. I don't think so. It's just gonna beat up on the public. Yeah, like I any don't... good cop when, does when they're frustrated. Ah, oh, come on. I'm not going All right, to. I gotta scan the original uh, pam uh, booklet here. All right. Uh, let's see, how can I connect the power pad, operations, uh, item use, squat, turn, circle. It has to do with two or three. The two or three have gotta be what you're using. Oh, you, 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 you did I it. found myself, no, I, I fell into a hole. Oh, okay. And the rat's beating me up. Like, I'm not even on the screen anymore. Use the six and seven to start and chase. Ben moves at three different speeds. How to turn corners, enter buildings. The turn left to enter a building on the left, yet you, you, you cross over your right foot to the two and then keep going. So, yeah, that should do it. That should be doing it. Nope, the rat's like beating me up. Well, now you gotta. All right, so try it. Try it again. As you get past it, no, but that's to the right. But I was well. It doesn't does it does it matter? Yeah. See now you need to turn to right. Well, that's left. I don't know why it's not working. Don't that's, know. What the, that's what the booklet says. I All don't right. know. I'm fucking up. All right, let's. Man, this thing ain't doing anything. It's, it's... That's an interesting concept. Well, it the control looks stops. like that's not actually a... Uh, maybe I need to get to the end of this. Sorry, I fucked it up. Uh, I was just curious to see what are the hole leads, considering I couldn't do anything else. Oh, apparently we can't get out of here. Oh, Ben, he's going to be eaten by rats. Is it a timing thing? Like, you have to really... Oh, it is okay. a timing thing. Need to go to the right. There we go. Oh. Okay. Well, that's annoying. Alright. So now we can go over here. I'm sorry, I wasted so much time in life. Oh, well, there we go. Got a little bit more time. Alright. Up, going the wrong way. I like this game, and I would like it better if I could control it with the normal controller. Yeah. Oh man, I gotta get all the way down there.
yeah, this is a... Uh, it's an interesting game, and it, it, if it weren't for the fact that I get so fucking exhausted, it wouldn't be so bad. Was working much better now than it was before. I mean, because I saw you push those buttons and it would do nothing. Yeah, I don't get it. But I'm glad it's working for you. Hey, you jumped oh, on them. Nice. Nice. The guy? That's the guy. Yep. There you go. You got him. Oh, okay. No, he's right there. Okay. At least he's close. No. I'm gonna go to the right. Okay. Yeah, I don't know why it wasn't working for me. Why I was yeah. why I was screwing up, but I guess I'm just bad. <laughs> These no, guys. no, it's that was total bullshit that before. Alright. Does no, that music mean something? I don't think so. It just means you're in a different area. In the alleyway. Maybe you have to go into the sewer for the last guy. Could be. Oh, yeah, I see. see, it's just different music for different areas. Oh, oh there no, we go. there he is. He's, he's on the road you're on. Yep, I... If, if the cop would stay in the... Same fucking direction for a moment. There he is. Oh. Uh, well, that's police brutality. Yeah. The bombs stun him, so. Nope. They oh, get no, him. they do kill him. Okay. I bombed him to death. It just takes three bombs to All right. get a crook. So I think we've adequately demonstrated this game. Yeah. Um, let's play Duck Hunt. Let's play, yeah. And next week we can do more Light Gun. Yeah. Because we got plenty of Light Gun games. I don't know if I have all the Light Gun games, but I could check that tomorrow. Yeah. And see what else I can get cheaply that could show up here for next weekend. Um, yeah, so we're going to turn this off and get some Light Gun going. We could going. definitely play a half hour of Duck Hunt. Yeah. We might even be able to play a little bit of like a second light gun game at least before we wrap it up. All right. So let's just go ahead and turn this off, and I'll be right back. Oh. 
good. So, um, bean bags are slightly better than the floor. That's true. Oh, thank you. That's a gentleman. Yes. Ah, so you got a controller. I do. And we got three choices here. <laughs> Only one of which actually uses the gun. And now, one duck is boring, but one duck allows whoever's got that controller to control the duck. Oh, right. I just use the, uh, the directional buttons. And it moves the duck in the direction as you go. All right. Which uh, you still don't stand a chance. Yeah, probably not. But, because I know how to use the sight on this thing. Woohoo, big man. You point with the sight, and it works. Before you even have a chance to move it. What's fun to do is to make it say fly away and then shoot it. Do you get more points? I don't think so, but it's bragging rights. Oh, I thought it was going to turn. I don't want it to Actually, have a quick... I think you do get more points. Huh. No, because there's a perfect score, and that doesn't change. Oh! <laughs> I got you that time. Okay, maybe it doesn't. I just... Yeah, because perfect is... Well, actually, I don't oh, actually Oh, no, know. that's the bonus you get for perfect. There we go. So we can, like, just keep trading because yeah. this ain't really much of a contest. Well, no. It's, oh, it's I stuck. see. Yeah. <laughs> Man, you take all your ammo. <laughs> Wait, there's ammo? Yeah, you only get three shots per turn. Oh. I didn't know that. Yeah, there's really only one way to truly play Duck Hunt, and that is the, on a wait, CRT TV with the original Nintendo. Oh, yeah, yeah. Emulation don't do it. Modern TVs can't do it. Um, the Wii um, Virtual Console version just isn't the same because you're not lining up a site. Ah. Uh, yeah, you got to get that between uh, Yeah, no, oh. I know. Oh. Maybe it's the angle here. Coming that. I, I am tilting the gun. Yeah, well, that's okay. I caught most of them. I don't play. I didn't play this very often. Yeah. Okay. There is that. Plus, it is fun just to shoot randomly at times. Yeah. Still want to get that VR version of this. Oh yeah. That <laughs> has that really kind of sinister. Uh, that creepy. Like the dog comes out of the TV in the middle of the night. Yeah, that creepy vibe to it. Well, yeah. I mean, it's not a vibe. The creepy atmosphere, creepy story. Uh, well, we need to get a VR set for headset first. Yeah. There we go. Uh, Jose Guzman said, uh, Yay, duck hunt, lol. The dog is laughing, lol. Yeah. Yeah. In the um, arcade version, you could shoot the dog. Because of course you can. You're the paying customer. <laughs> well, it's a bonus round on the arcade game where 
there's like ducks or it, it, it's a different style level and the dog jumps up at some points in it ah. and if you hit the dog that you know ends that round because you're not supposed to so that's right bad. i mean that's your hunting dog but you can't help but shoot him every damn time you know right because he had well, he it gets, coming to him he gets in the way and he's a bit of a dick i mean it's it? you're out in the field of fire jumping up what do you expect yeah dumb dog and and then he comes out on like crutches and like gripes at you for it and it's like dude what are you out there jumping around with the ducks for in front of a guy with a gun? I mean, yeah. <laughs> That's gonna happen. You're gonna get shot. I... I thought it was really weird when uh, they uh, introduced uh, the duck hunt dog and duck. Dog and, dog and duck for um, Super Smash Brothers. That is weird. Was that on the Wii U version? Yeah. Do we have that? Yes, we do. So I could play as the dog? Yeah, you can play as the dog. I'm pretty sure I unlocked Which is dog. great, because I'd normally lose, and I'd be like, yeah, dog, you're going down. <laughs> I'd have to... I, I, it, you have to unlock them. Oh. So I'm not sure if I've unlocked that one or not. I think I may have. But yeah, Wii Fit Trainer, the dog, Duck Hunt. Oh. Um, some really interesting ones that are coming, you know, that they've uh, decided to add in. What about the power pad? Uh, just the power pad? Yeah, I well, mean, they got the robot, right? Yeah, yeah, Rob is definitely one of them. So, so they could do the power They pad. could totally do the power pad. Or they could do uh, the rookie cop. Rookie cop, yeah, go. Ben the rookie cop. Oh, it feels good. <laughs> uh, Jose writes a wild gunman is also shoot him up. Oh, shit. I don't know if I had that one. We got, I have a lot of like on games. I got Gumshoe. I've got, um, what is it? Gotcha's the paintball one. I got the yeah. Hogan's Alley. I think those there are the pop. I don't know if, what else they made for the light gun other than those. Those are the ones that I always remembered seeing around when growing up. Pew pew. <laughs> <laughs> like all the other gun peripherals, because like the Wii did come out with like gun peripherals. They don't feel as good as this one. Hmm. Well, no, this was the only real gun peripheral that really worked with Sensing the TV. Well, I don't. Well, yeah, but I'm I don't know how about, the Super like, Nintendo one worked. The Wii had, you know, you slot it into, you slot the remote into the different controllers, like we have the uh, the. Uh, but it's not sensing where you're pointing at the TV. It's no. sensing the motion, mm -hmm. so it's not going to work the same. Now, the Super Scope for the SNES, I'm not sure how that one worked, and I only, yeah, I never. That cool. I remember that one. You calibrated. By aiming at a target and then it's firing and it's like what if your aim is off to start with then your calibration is going to be off well, of course yeah but I That's mean it is the problem with calibration it is pretty much a stationary target with a clear bullseye so yeah but still you know even shooting a bullseye is shooting a bullseye I don't know I uh, I never I, I I might I might have to pick up a super scope so we can play with it. <laughs> the super scope SNES game, like with the six games that would come with it, is a readily available cartridge that you can find for like you know a buck in many fine uh, retail uh, establishments of used materials. Mm -hmm. So we'll probably could find one at uh, the. Uh, I was gonna say the time capsule. But that's oh, not yeah. the one I was thinking of. Or the flea market, or the... Uh... the I was thinking of the, the store in the mall. Oh, yeah, the toy the store toy, the, mall. the toy box or whatever. Yeah, the toy... I think it's called the toy box. Ah. Oh. This is much nicer than the power <laughs> It is. Much more my speed. Quack, 
ác <laughs> yeah. This is one I rem I don't remember playing a lot, but I remember watching a lot. Oh, oh damn. Well, I remember, you know, when, when you first play it and you don't learn how to really play it with the sight, you, you just get fed up and just walk up to the TV and start putting the gun right on the screen. There we go. Alright, now you have to get one of these last two or it's game over. There we go. I'm good. I haven't missed more than three, so at least that's something. Yeah. When you close your eye to squint to aim, which eye do you close? Left eye. I, I close my right eye. Oh. And yet I'm right-handed. I don't know. It seems like that kind of thing has to do with what hand you're using. Oh. I don't know. I know my dad can't close one eye, so like, if we went to the gun club for Boy Scout meeting, he wouldn't shoot because he's like, "Oh, I gotta get an eye patch," which he never did. <laughs> <laughs> I mean, I can't. Cl I if I want to close my left eye, I have to close both eyes. I can't close it uh, by itself. Well, I can. Cool. I guess I could do the other eye. Let's try. But my left eye is much weaker than my right eye. Oh yeah, don't don't do it. If he, but that's neat. You can do that. Yeah. I, I can't. No, I mean like the vision in my left eye is significantly oh, weaker. Oh yeah. I I have uh, when I when I would wear reading glasses, left eye had a significantly stronger prescription. Ah damn. Oh now here's where things get interesting. Oh, well. I don't think I'm going to last much longer on this one. Ah, oh, you did that on purpose. No, I didn't. I was pushing down, and it went up. I don't think it's listed to my controls all that much. Yeah, because these ducks are much faster. Shit. Oh. Oh. There, now I'm doing that on purpose. <laughs> well, that was kind of you. And here I was bragging but about how I missed it. Uh, there we go. All right, we, you, you got to get all these last three. Come on. There you go. Oh, come on. <laughs> well, I want to go on to the next level. I want to see my good. Fine. I've worked hard for that good. Fine, it's fine. You, then you don't pass it on. Good. Yes, I did good. I made it. <laughs> don't just then ho keep holding on to it. Don't pass it to me. Okay. If you insist. Well, if you're con that concerned about it. Well, I want to at least get through level ten. We'll see how far you can go. All right. I'm not even going to mess with you with a controller. I mean, this is when the real game starts. Oh! Money. I mean, that's what the the dog, the dog laughing reminds me of. Muttley from Wacky Racers and... You know, uh, Dirk Dastardly and Muttley had a spin-off ca spin cartoon? Huh? Where they're trying to catch a, like a, um, a messenger pigeon. Because they were apparently spies again, or like, they're working against some... They're the end, it was a, you know, because like, messenger pigeons were used during war, so they had to have been right. enemy combatants. The pigeon, you're supposed to be rooting for the pigeon, even though, like, they're like the most one of the more interesting racers in Wacky Racers. I guess that's why no one knows about the cartoon. Because Wacky Racers is so much better. I mean everybody on Wacky Racers had their own cartoon. It was a big crossover. 
and yet Wacky Racers is more has it was more uh, popular than some of the cartoons that existed. Oh. Hey, you made you made it though. So apparently, this game has a kill screen level on um, round ninety nine or a hundred. It just kind of freaks out, and you get like half ducks that kind of appear and disappear in different places. Oh man, how cool! And uh, which makes it pretty hard to beat. Well, yeah. But if you do get past it, it goes back to normal. How interesting! Just the moment. I think that's only on the one duck game that does that. Uh-huh. Just a momentary overflow. The next number wrecks oh. it. Oh, speaking of overflow, um, did you hear? I don't know if you probably you probably didn't hear. Followed seventy seven had an issue where um, I heard it had a major bug where like all nukes stopped working or something. Yeah, like the new year happened. It turned twenty nineteen, and oh. all the nukes stopped working. Oh, like, I didn't realize it was clock. Uh, so yeah. is, are they patching that? I take. Oh it? yeah, they have to patch it because that's like end game. That's what you're working towards. This is the silo. Like, it locked, and it said, oh, it'll unlock in uh, 9,999 9, hours. <laughs> so, <laughs> yeah, they're, they're, they got to patch that shit. Well, they just set the clock ahead a bunch of hours. And yeah, the basically. Just set your calendar on your system ahead. It's weird, because you think, like, oh, well, they just didn't expect it to last that long, but they came out in, like, November. Yeah, it you know? just came out. Yeah. It's like, well, you know, a good five minutes and everyone will have this game beaten and no one will want to play it again. Like, fuck him. What's up with that? Like, Bethesda has some really bad game-breaking bugs at times. But that's that takes the cake. Although, I, you know, like, whether or not you think nukes should be a thing in a game that takes place after nuclear war... And you're trying to rebuild your, you know, rebuild society after nuclear war. But here, hey, have more nukes. Yeah. Nice. Good job. It's just a weird thing to happen in a, you know, in these modern times where we know about this kind of thing. Yeah. It's a Y2K bug in 2019. Y2K19 bug. Yeah. Oh, well, this might be it. <laughs> I'm not sure what the furthest level I've gotten to is in this. Usually I make it past 10, so usually somewhere in the teens is where I... Uh... Oh! No! No, that's no fair! Oh, you're doing so well! I'm doing so fucking well! Oh, that all-seeing oh. eye is judging you. <laughs> Whatever. <laughs> Game uh. was like, yeah, you... You think you're doing so well? Fuck you. Oh. Here, play some clay shooting. All right. This is a fun game. Oh, come on! All right. Whatever you want to play. All right, let's give this a well. round, and then we'll play like one other game. Oh, oh they only three shots. Right. I thought I had that one. <laughs> oh well. Oh, 
Nope. Hey, hit two though. Hooray! <laughs> Aww. Three out of ten. That's you know thirty percent. That is a failing grade. That's gotta be grade. worth something. Would yeah. I'm gonna? Uh, well, you can try. Show me how it's done. All right. Sharpshooter. <laughs> so this is what shooting a real gun is is like, right? Um, yeah, totally. I'm just checking to see if Dune's still watching. <laughs> <laughs> you know, you can put it right up to your face and you're no problems. Yeah, yeah, totally, uh... Totally safe. Not gonna get a black eye doing this. Nope. both of those off the first shot. I'm just <laughs> looking to see. Yeah. He might be getting ready yeah. for his own show. Uh, I think he's already started. Well, oh. he's definitely prepping. I don't know. Does it start at 10 this time? So 11 our time? I don't know. Uh, or does it start 10 our time? I don't know. I uh, don't know. One or the other. What? Well, yeah. Or something completely different from what I said. Click on it. Yeah. Oh, my. Oh. That mm. was, no, it's okay. I can't. What the heck? I had those. Well, you got one of them. All right. There we go. on top of my game here. There you go. Showing the game who's boss. Yep. Yeah, I'll do one more round of this and we'll find another game to end the night with. Okay. Jumping. <laughs> every time you pull, every time you pull the trigger, she does a little. <laughs> she hasn't figured out this is this a normal thing now. <laughs> no. For the next few minutes. Yeah. Oh, did I say that was the last round? Oh, we'll do this round. We'll go until I miss one. Okay. Oh, you missed. Oh. All right, well, that's that. All right, so what should we play? Uh, uh, gotcha, Hogan's Alley, or Gumshoe? Um, how about Gotcha? Gotcha, okay. I don't know how much time we have left, but I don't think we have that too much time left. Well, any of the games are... I what? guess they're all kind of quick. Yeah, they're all... Thank you, pew, 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 pew.
cartridge. Yeah. Because our games are just not cooperating with us tonight. I don't use... Yeah, Nintendo cartridge are finicky, but I usually don't have as much trouble as I'm having today. Just while you're doing that, I'm gonna... Yeah, okay. I'm gonna play. That makes sense. I'm gonna so give we this have a... to have the system on for the mics to work, because that's how that works. Ah. Not aiming properly. So, people might have seen me looking down the barrel of the light gun. That is not proper gun safety procedures. Do not do that unless you are looking down the barrel of a N N Nintendo Zapper light gun. You don't want to shoot your eye out. Or worse. Exactly. Ah, balls. Now, if this was a, if I had a mouse and keyboard, I would totally be pwning you ducks, noob ducks. <laughs> and actually, no, I can't. Actually, I could probably use WASD with my hand the way it is. Oh, maybe I should do that. Try to play Wolfenstein or something. I don't have many shooters for PC. Even though that is the best way to play, like, first-person shooters. Give us a nice, good cleaning. All right. If you want to finish this round. Yeah, why not? Sticking with the one duck. Yeah. Yeah. Like, I have enough problems with <laughs> trying to shoot one duck. Although I guess if you throw two in there, then that means I miss twice as much. Oh well. Or there's. You know, you're, you're more likely to hit something by chance when there's more things on there. I mean, there's that. Too. There is that. That's being positive, is that what, what yeah. that is? All right, let's try swapping this cartridge again and see if we can play some gotcha. The sports. No, I believe this game requires using both the controller and the gun because it's a flag capture game with paintball oh, right. guns. So you're not actually killing people over flags. No. You're just painting them. So you want to hold that in one hand. So you're... Here. Oh, well, I, I think you're supposed to do both. All right. I'll try this. Uh, yeah, you, why don't you try I, that? I think, I, don't... I think you're supposed to do both. I... So you got to get across to capture their... And if, if someone captures our flag, you see it move, and of course you have a chance to get them once you pass them. Because you want to capture the flag and get it to your side. See, now that means someone's got a flag. Yeah. So you're moving that. Yeah. Come on! I hit him like five fucking times! I guess we could do one do one, one do the other. That way all you gotta do is worry about shooting. Uh. You want me to go back so you can get the guy who's got the flag? Yeah, sure. 
reasons for... There we go. Oh! All this cleaning and the game's glitching already. I mean, I clean the crap out of that. Oh, shit, that guy in the tree. Yeah. Alright. Oh, we got the flag. Nice. So I guess we got a number of lives or something? It seems that way. There you go, you got him. Sorry, I wasn't lining them up. Oh, shit. Grab the flag instead. But I think, yeah, see, we're okay. Okay. Oh, we're out of ammo. Oh. All right. Do you want to try again? Yeah, let's do one more. Only waste um, waste ammo when you miss. That's weird. It is, isn't it? But I guess that's nice. Yeah, it is. That's something the strategy, but that's not real true to life. Well, no. like five times. There we go. Where does it show us our ammo? Oh, I see. Top seven. corner. Yeah. All right, we to... I thought I got that guy in the tree. Yeah. 
one's got her. Sight is off on this game. Because it should not take me that many hits to get that guy, because I yeah. didn't even move the gun, and then it's like, oh, yeah, I see you, you got me. Yeah, no, that's All right. frustrating. Yeah, All well. All right, you think this is... I, I think mean, we're being yelled at from upstairs, so... Yeah, and we got to make the bed, because we had um, to clean yeah. the cat pee, and we got Yay, clothes Yay, cat pee. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We got a laundry to tend to. Yay, Yay laundry, adulting. adult. <laughs> All right, well, thanks again for uh, joining us. Uh, yeah, I hope you guys enjoyed the show, enjoyed watching us sweat and, and try to get the stupid cop to move down the stupid alleyway. Little fucker. Uh, he likes you better than he likes me. That's the way it goes. Yeah. All right, well, we'll be back next week with more light gun as uh, Lummy's hand heals. Mm -hmm. And, um... Books, kids. You gotta be careful of your books. She hurt her hand on books. Yeah, I was reading. She was reading heavy-duty, hardcore reading. Um, and next week, this tree won't be in the way. Yeah. Tomorrow, this tree won't be in the way. Yeah, we're getting... The tree is going outside. The tree is going outside. And Where away. trees belong. This tree has been nothing but pain. It's... it's even, I, I, don't, I don't know if it's worse because... Because it's dry, but it, it's definitely bitten me several times today. Mm. Anyway. Anyways, thank you all for watching, and uh, we'll be back next week. Have a, have a good, I hope your rest of your weekend's good, and we'll see you later. Good night. Bye.